Hello everyone, my name is Alvaro, I work for GANDV and today I'm going to teach you how to uh, initialize GAN. So the first thing we got to do is, we, uh, the way I'm going to do this is uh, I'm going to create a local server. So we're going to be using NPM, if you don't know what it, that is, that's a node package module, even though a lot of people say that's not, it, that's, that's not what NPM means. Uh, that's what a lot of people know it for, so let's get started. Oh, and if you don't know what a node is, don't worry, you're probably we're sleeping in a uh, cryogenic uh, chamber and just woke up. So let's get to it. So the first thing we got to do is, if you don't know how to use npm, you're going to go to npmjs.com and we're going to look for gun. Here it is. Got here we have instructions on how to install it. So let's follow it. We're gonna go to npm install gun. Before I hit enter, I just want to show you my the folder where I'm gonna be working at it has nothing, only server server.js that I'm gonna show you how uh, why I have it there. And that uh, in my terminal. Um, in that folder, can be tutorials, can be tutorials, and now we execute this line. So as you can see, it's creating our node modules, and we have the GAN folder and everything that and everything that comes in that package. Now, because I'm going to be creating a local server, I'm going to use GAN server, a uh, library that uh, Psycholama Jesse created. Oh, sorry, this is GAN level. I'm completely different animal. So, a GAN server. Uh, here are the instructions npm install. Gun server, and we want to save this. We're gonna go to a folder. What I'm gonna see is, as you can see, we have the gun server saved. And finally, uh, we're gonna use Express to create this uh, this uh, local server as well. So npm install Express. Sweet, we have our Express uh, package module here. Now we go to our text editor. I'm using Sublime. Oh, and this piece of code is was it's uh, was letting me have my local server run. So I'm requiring GAN. I'm requiring Express, and I'm gonna be listening in port 8080. So to run that, we're going to go to a terminal. And we're going to type node and the name of a file that is server.js. If you did it correctly, you're going to get this message from Mark. And now we're going to create, uh, we're going to start with that application. I'm going to Save this automatically, and I'm gonna call it test.html. Oh, HTML. Sorry. Uh, save it. Uh, usually, you would be having, you know. Oh, let's first instantiate that, and then I'm gonna keep going with what I was saying. Script. And our source is going to be gun.js. And as I was talking before, you usually have a, a JS file that you create in in the pro, in your project, but for practicality purposes, we're just gonna have it here. 
So I have another script. Get rid of this whole thing. And inside this, we are going, the first thing we're going to do when you want to start our GAM project is instantiate the database. How do we do that? Well, we come to our read our documentation, GAM constructor, that's the main thing. So we're going to create a variable called GAN. Then we're going to have GAN and options. Our options can are it's usually a string but can be objects, it can be arrays, and if you uh, read this document you'll see all the options you have. So to sync with one peer, we uh, call gun and uh, pass a string with the URL of the server you're gonna be working with. If you work if you're gonna be working with many peers you can have an array as I was saying before. One, two. You can be working with modules and uh, unique ID identifiers. So let's start with ours. So we call variable gun. We're gonna have gun and you know we created this local server, right? So a uh, URL would be, yep, you guessed it. It's going to be our local host. Eighty eighty dash gun. Now, how are we going to know that this is working? So right now, I'm going to put uh, a typical message: "Hello world." And here, we're going to see if gun is really working. So we're going to throw console log, console log, and gun. Save this, go to the browser, localhost 8080, oh, sorry, 8080, oh, it's, uh, oh because I called this test, so test.html, here it is, hello world, we go to our console, and here it is. We have gun. Well, this is all for now. I'll be coming back with more tutorials. Let me know if you like this. Uh, see you next time.